Hello, Banju, Banju, Banju. Let me be there in your morning. Let me be there in your night. That we saw now. We yeah, want to they up. give me beds, guys. We are done with our last antenna in this hospital, as far as I'm concerned. Baby's head is down. I don't know why you're so excited to go and use that. Yeah. No, it's not. I'm, I'm not excited to say I'm using that place. It's the situation. What situation? No, well, any hospital you want us to use. No, it's not about anywhere I want us to use. Now. Yes, no, anywhere you want us to use, we are getting we used. Are so now our checkup is going to be every one one week. So this is 35 weeks. So we have 36, 37, two, three weeks. We should be giving birth. By God's grace. <laughs> Amen. No, we'll see our baby. <laughs> our baby is already weighing 2.5 kg at this time. Our baby is going to be big old because. I heard someone that told me that her baby was 2.5. Even her baby at this time is 2.5 kg. What is going to happen in the next three weeks? <laughs> Anyways, so, so we are. Uh, yeah, our baby is blessed. Blessed, blessed. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. So we are on our way home now. Yes, we are. And. In the womb. I mean, this is the belly. In the womb. <laughs> this is the belly. That's the belly <laughs> of the baby. In the womb. <laughs> this is the belly. Okay. The baby in the belly. In the womb. Excited is an understatement. I'm happy. Yep. I'm glad. Yep. Check one, two. I don't know what episode are we in now. I get to see it in the title. <laughs> okay, so today, uh, in case you are new to this channel, this is Yomi and Anu channel. And I am Anu, my husband is Yomi, and it's not here obviously because this is my pregnancy journey series. You're seeing once in a while popping up and down the, the videos. But today I have to give updates on this will be week. I'm currently in week 34 plus. Yeah. Maybe 34 plus uh two days, uh, three days, there about. Yeah, I'm going to week 35 and this is my this is my pregnancy belly. Oh week 35. Yeah, week 34 plus. So I'm basically going to be 35. Yay! <laughs> so I'm also going to be unboxing this gift. Somebody gave me a gift. One of my captains. Come here, let me get it. So one of my captains gave me this very beautiful gift. It's a breast form. Yeah. And we are going to be unboxing it today together. Oops. Oh my god. So far, before we unbox this breast pump, as you can see, it's an electric wearable breast pump. I love it so much. I've not even seen it. I don't know how it looks like, but I know it's going to be nice. I've read everything about the body because I want to unbox it with you guys. Yeah. But before we go into the unboxing, I want to talk about symptoms I felt in this 32, 33, 34 wait so far 
sleeping has not been so fun. I keep carrying my belly this way, that way. It's not been really, really easy. Found it stressful sleeping. And still facing this heat issue. I don't know whether I say heat issue, like I'm always sweating. So I even prefer not to wear anything. Like I'm always, always sweating. So uh, I'll say my sweat glands have increased. It has even heightened. But there's something I noticed during the first trimester and early part of the second trimester, I was growing a lot of hairs. Like if I shave in one week, like everywhere is already full and all that. And like I keep shaving and shaving. But I discovered that during this third trimester, hairs don't grow as much as they were during the first trimester. I don't know, maybe because some hormones have gone down or because baby is fully developed and all that. I really don't know how it works. But these are some things I just noticed. I also noticed that I get full quick. I think I talked about that in the last video, but I get full quick anyways. And what else have I noticed? I'm getting heavier. So I can walk a little and I'm like, just allow me. So... These are a few things I've noticed in this week. So let's go into unboxing this. Um, I didn't get. I need to get something to open this. Okay, so I decided to get a knife. I decided to get a knife to open it because I don't think the scissors is going to do a good job because you have to pass through the cut on side. But some things uh, you can see on this breast form. They say expresses milk more it has nine suction levels painless milk pumping is it not when i start using it i will know whether it's painless <laughs> i don't know but they say painless milk pumping nine massage levels no leak design hands-free i like the fact that it's hands-free and i like the fact that it's electric because you can just be moving around and that's exactly what i think I really wanted and here they put unique massage shield easy to express more milk 140 degrees wide angle makes the breast pump fit the breast better hands-free design wireless free mothers wireless free mother's hands painless design comfortable massage and sucking frequency breast milk capacity warning this is also a nice one because that means if that's full. It can tell me enough. That kind of stuff. I can see the warning sign. Easy to weave invisible design. I really don't know what that means. And so you have some specifications at the back. Let me just show you guys. Because I'm not ready to keep reading that. <laughs> so now let us unbox this guy. I don't even know whether we are cutting it right today, but I just I just hope yeah this is tough right okay I'm supposed to be seeing a place to okay perfect oops okay that was not so perfect as I thought okay now we got it here <laughs> it says hello bonjour Okay, some things we can find in here. I have bra extender. Or what I can see is a yeah, bra extender, just one here. And 
you type C chord. Okay. I can also see same thing here. One bright extender and type C chord. So I have two bright extenders and two type C chords. Okay. I really don't know what this is until I read the manual, but um, I really don't know. <laughs> I'm interested in seeing the breast pump itself. Okay. Wow. This is the breast pump. Okay, and it can take up to 180 mils. Uh, I can see the calibration here. And here, the calibration is in three sides. One, one, two, three. And I can see this part, the power button different suction level plus minus when i start using it guys i'm going to do the review obviously i can't start using it now because it's not yet time and i have to read the manual okay it has two of uh it's really beautiful and it's white so this is what we have here same things. So I'm gonna put it and and do what it's meant for. Okay, what else is in here? And obviously we have the manual, so I have to take my time, read the manual, know how it works. And let me let me look for that thing I said I don't know what it was. That's a silicone diaphragm. Uh, yeah, that's a silicone diaphragm. So you have one inside, then you have that extra. So that thing I'll show you guys is the silicone diaphragm. Because they all pointed it out here. And I think you can dislodge this guy. Oh, you see why it's good to read. You can dislodge this guy and wash this one. And Put it back. You put it back. <laughs> okay, so things that came inside type C cable, which I showed you guys: bra adjustment buckle, the pump motor, the silicone flat. There's a silicone flat there. The silicone valve. It's there. There's silicone valve here. Silicone diaphragm, which is that one I showed you guys. I don't know then. We have the silicone flang, which is this one inside. Silicone diaphragm, which is this one here. What else? The linker. There's a linker. This 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 one in here is the linker. So that is it, guys, for the breast pump unboxing. I pray that this breast pump serves us well. Name, amen and god bless the person that gifted me this <laughs> i'm really really happy so like i keep saying send your gifts send your gifts send them <laughs> okay guys thank you so much for joining me in this my pregnancy journey trust me i really really appreciate your love your concern and you being part of the journey yes means a lot pregnancy is something very very delicate in life and i was just discussing with my husband yesterday that i wonder why people would decide to give to get pregnant for people they don't like because this journey is too it's too serious like i cannot i cannot think of it i beg i beg i beg and people have 10 children Ah, 12. 
They are trying. They are really, really trying. Seriously. Guys, it's not easy. But God will make it easy in Jesus' name. So, till I meet you guys next time. Bye and thanks for joining me.